Hey guys, it's Ruby. Today I'm going to be showing you my room because I've recently decorated it for fall slash Halloween. I know it's a little bit early, but I'm very festive, so my room just had to be decorated. Right now, I'm in my walk-in wardrobe. I didn't do anything to my walk-in wardrobe, but let me actually show you my bedroom, which is just behind this door. I just kind of tripped, ouch. But this is my walk-in wardrobe chat. Thank you. This is my walk-in wardrobe door. And all I got was this boo sign from Sheen. Um, they used my dressing gown here, but I kind of moved my dressing gown because I thought this was just like really pretty. And I don't know why, but this reminds me of Beetlejuice. It's not that big. My sister has actually tried to steal this because she liked it. Next up, we move. Oh my gosh, that's really bright. Oh! I don't know if you'll be able to see. So I did just put some bat stickers all over my window. It kind of actually scares me at night time. Stupidly, I thought this would be cute to put up vines and like these really pretty ghost lights. I did get the vines and the ghost lights from Sheen as well. But oh, the thing is, by doing that, I can't close my curtains, which kind of sucks because I'm really used to my curtains being closed. I have two of these cute little pumpkins. These are actually real. I got them for Sainsbury's for a pound. And when I saw them, I was like, oh, they're gonna probably go off and they're gonna stink, but it's worth it because they are so cute. Next, I do have this Vampire Diaries. Next off, I do have this Vampire Diaries jewelry set. Um, Vampire Diaries is one of my favorite TV shows, so it just kind of sits here. I don't exactly, re oh my gosh. I don't exactly wear them often. Then this isn't Halloween-y, but it's just my money box. I have this really cute little lantern light, which I got from a local shop. It lights up at nighttime and my other pumpkin. And I just have some vines here. Next on, I've got like two hangers. So now like my coats and my dressing gown are literally just stuffed in my closet but i've got this really cute macrame moon ornament i don't know i just i think it's really cute don't mind the mess on my door by the way like it even smells nice like when it came out of the package it smelled like vanilla and i was really shocked i was like why does it smell like vanilla the m m store for me when you get down to the basement in london guys if you've ever been when you go down it smells like vanilla i don't know why like it should smell of chocolate next up guys i've got this so up here i have got my teddies i got this from builder bear it has my nan's voice in it don't worry i'm not a psychopath it's just uh she got this really terrible disease where she um, she couldn't like talk anymore. She got motor neuron, so you couldn't hear her voice. So I got that. It's not because I'm obsessed and I'm a stalker. No. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> Next up, I have this lamb, which was hers. I always use a snuggle of this. And then I got Kirby the kangaroo. I got that from when we went to a safari park. And I got this really cute little panda. Then moving on to my next shelf, I've got this artsy ornament. No, I don't actually use it to draw. But it's just like got my jewelry. I have Elena's necklace and a little shell necklace. Then I got my pineapple. And I just have my Polaroid. It doesn't get used often. And I just got two little shells. Whenever I find shells are always broken, I think I've just got like a shell curse. So I bought them because I don't think in England you're ever gonna find a pretty shell like this on the beach. But you might, but there's like a 0.0001% chance. On the other shelf, I have got the Eiffel Tower. I got this from Paris when I went. I really wanted one of these. Um, it doesn't work anymore because I think I accidentally left the light on. But it usually does like glow up and the lights go like that. I have just got this nice smelly thing to make my room smell nice i have a clock and i've got like this hole just full of shells that i bought um again they're not from the english sea the only thing i think you'd find in the english sea is a wheel from a trolley you're never gonna find shells like that next up i have got um this is just pictures and i've got a little scream character on there i just have a candle i never use and i have this boo sign it should light up the hair clip's not supposed to be here next up we have a big picture of lady my little baby and this skull i got this from the range next up um i did decorate my bed oh also i've completely forgot to say for you guys who are watching who live in america we do have shops um that 
aren't in America, like the range in Sainsbury's. So if you don't know what they are, Sainsbury's is just like a supermarket, like Target or Walmart. And the range is kind of just like, um, it's like a furniture shop, but it's also not at the same time. It's like a department basically. But I don't know where I got my bed from. I got my bed two years ago. I'm sure you guys will remember it because I have done multiple videos sitting on my bed because it is comfy. I got these blue lights and I put small vines. I think I'm just like obsessed with vines. I'm gonna have like a poison ivy bed. I have now, no, it is not the Batman sign. I'm not really a Batman fan, but it does glow like really citrusy neon blue. Hi. And I got this adorable duvet cover from Sheen. I got my duvet cover and these pillows. <gasps> oh, look. A Ouija board. Is somebody here? Yeah, that's just my bed. <laughs> yeah, this is my mirror. I got this from Wayfair. I love it so much. I did put vines. Again. I feel like, like, on the side of the screen, we need to have, like, a vine count. So, like, put here a vine count on how many vines I have in my room. Oh. Oh, my gosh. What? What on earth? What? I didn't even scratch my neck. Are you guys seeing that? I literally have got, like, scratch marks. Oh, my gosh. I literally have scratch marks on my neck. Guys. Can you start scratching my neck, please? Thank you. Anyway, on the top, I have a Halloween sign. That's actually right. Oh my gosh, at home. Hi, guys. I love this sign, although it falls down a lot because of the ghosts. I'm, I'm going to keep reminding you guys, I live in a 160-something-year-old house, so this room is haunted. And that falls down all the time. I think the ghosts are, like, offended of the sign, so they're, like, just, like, going to chuck it down. I have got a plum, which I got from B&M. B&M is also, like, a department store. B&M is the best. And then I got this stuff. Well, it's like my moon one, but it's a star. Not interesting. And then <laughs> my messy closet. Um, yeah, it's just full of a lot of jibber jabber, to be honest. Oh, actually, guys, I have got this photo album. Not really relevant to the video, but I'll show you anyway. Of me as a little child. Look, there I am. There's me as a baby. I kind of like Chucky, to be honest. Oh, also, what is relevant to the... Oh, my gosh, my hair got away. Ugh. What is relevant to the video is... Why it's a mess is because all my decorations which have been replaced with my Halloween ones go in there. Next to my mirror, I have a lot of pictures. Now, I did make these myself. I didn't buy them anywhere. I just bought the plain canvases from Flying Tiger. So I made this one and I made this one. I'm not really an artist. I just kind of messed around with it. This one's one of my favorite. I love this one so much. And I made that one. This orange, like, it's like glow in the dark paint, I think. So at night, you'll just see like random blobs on my canvas. I got a little token from from Roblox from 2020, which I like to keep up there. Look, there's Amelia. There's me. There's Bonnie sleeping. Uh, there's Lady. Now, my desk. So I have got some footage of me putting up these vines. They took two hours. tape i should have done it uh with like a, a better method but all i had was tape and i'm impatient so they have also got these really cute fairy lights so that's what my vine wall looks like and then my desk nothing interesting i did get my desk from wayfair and i got my chair from wayfair as well and oh my god i love this pillow <laughs> lonely ghost support group it's like seriously one of my favorite pillows and also i've got massive squish mellow pillow that i like to sit on also my luxurious soft rug but that's not important so over here i've got a sign that says halloween 2021 i did get this from sheen i got this cute little angel figure and i actually didn't buy this i got got this um i actually got this from a fan so if you guys are still watching who sent me this thank you so much i've kept it all these years i really love it then i got this beautiful crystal from sheen it's like so gorgeous and i got this cute little pumpkin mm -hmm. this is my mug oh i really love a good cup of tea can't you tell i'm british but what 
last but not least um, is my plain wall. Now, I kind of regret painting it just white. I really wish I put like wallpaper or like maybe like a beige pink. I don't know what these are. I think they're called like ostrich feathers and these are from Sheen. They're like full colors. I will get like different colors when it comes to winter. I'll get like a blue and yeah, Christmassy and it's in this little vase. And I have these really cute, adorable little pumpkins and a ghost. Look at him, guys. You know what? I'll quickly show you my walking wardrobe. Why not? I've done my whole room. I might as well show you my walking wardrobe. It's nothing special, though. So when you go in, you go down this step. Very dangerous because you slip a lot. I got my tiny little window. Now, this window is actually the original window from the Victorian times. I don't know how you're supposed to escape from there, though. Like, let me just show. Rude, don't close on me. Look, I can't exactly, like, get out. This is as far as I can get. So, like... If that was the only window I had to escape, I'd pretty much be buggered. Next, I've got my vanity. Now, believe it or not, I never use this vanity, sadly. But, um, yeah, I got my cute little music box. Perfume stuff, unicorn. Yeah, it's not important. Then I got my clothes. This is where I put all my t-shirts. This is where I put all my jumpers. And this is actually where I put all of my merch, guys. This is like my collector's merch. So this is my first ever merch. And I've got from like, look, Be Yourself. This actually does not exist anymore. Um, Oh my gosh, throwback. Do you guys remember my glow-in-the-dark Ruby Ruby hoodie? And then these are like my dresses and my coats. Boring. And then, yeah, I don't think you guys want to see. Yeah, it's just boring. It's very boring. Guys, I'm actually going to end it here. Luckily, you didn't hear too much drilling in the background. Let me know what you think about my Halloween decorated room. Do you guys like it? And let me know for me to do an update when it comes to Christmas. Make sure you subscribe and smash the like button. And I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.